As part of activities to commemorate Workers Day, a Lagos State Ministry of Establishments, Training and Pension have organized an event at Mobalaji Johnson Arena Onikong Stadium. Governor Babajide Songolu, while encouraging the workers, decided to surprise them with a gift of five hectares of land each in Budagri and Idera in Ikurudu to the Nigerian Labour Congress and the Trade Union Congress with other promises. Plus TV Africa's correspondent Jacinta Obuku reports. May 1st is International Labour Day, also known as Workers' Day, a day set aside to celebrate laborers and to also encourage them to be aware of their rights. In Lagos, workers' unions gathered and seated in stalls and colors to celebrate and lay bare their challenges and complaints before the state governor whom they await anxiously. Few minutes into the start-up time of the event is the arrival of the Lagos State Governor Babajide Sangulu. The workers' unions gave their welcome addresses and moved straight to tabling their request. Mr. Governor, the rate at which negotiations are now being attacked at night, particularly in terms of becoming worse, we are feeling that necessary actions be taken to protect the lives of negotiators. Our good governor, sir, we have come again this year to also appeal and beg that as big as the workers' union is, NSC has 56 affiliate unions representing about 130,000 workforce in the public sector alone. We don't have a secretariat. The governor, having heard their complaints, gets to the podium to have them addressed. As responsible decision makers, we have respected the faithful and upheld the guidelines as stated by the International Labour Organization and will continue to work with the two bodies in Lagos State, the TUC and the NLC, at ensuring that whatever gray areas we still have, we will resolve them, we will work with them amicably. These are the documents for the paper. Application for land in private, this is the DERA scheme, five hectares. This is um, mixed development in Badagri, five hectares. Issues concerning pensions was part of what he addressed. We have increased, from what I'm told, the allowance we pay our pensioners. There's something that we've, we've done with them and we've ensured that our pensioners are paid as we pay our monthly salaries. Some of the workers expressed how they feel and take home message. I'm really, really happy about the express approval of governor to some of our requests right here. Really said so many things and we're happy. We're proud as workers, not just as workers, as Lagos state workers. And we have promised ourselves that we're going to put more efforts. The activities to mark today is not without a match past. a tough journey for workers all over the world, especially since the heat of the pandemic. But in a day like this, is to celebrate and still encourage workers to keep up with a good job and to understand that life is not without challenges. From Mobilaji Johnson Arena, Oniko, and Lagos Island, Jacinta Obuku reporting for PLOS TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.